As we went in the courthouse, and went into the office there where you sign up, the old judge jumped up and come back and hugged my mom, and he said, Oh, Edith, I haven't seen you for so long, but I knew you. And he used to teach, he was old Judge Henry Ashcraft, and he was judge here till he died. And I, I think he died, I'm sure he did. And, uh, uh, he said, why do you, come? you're not getting married, are you? And she said, no, my daughter here is. And he said, who's that? She said, well, and she said, she, uh, we have to sign for it. And uh, she, he said, where's dad? He said, he didn't come. He said, he said, I could sign for him. He said, oh, no. Oh, no, he said. But he said, either to, to, for you, he said, I'll come down tonight and open up the courthouse and let and you bring Ernest and come in again. Oh, and, and Ernest will sign in front of all of us and he'll be all right. Mom said, go home. What if Ernest can't go? Well, I, I said, I guess we'll have to put her wedding off for a while. So Dad came in. He said, no, I'll clean up and I'll go up and sign up. So they opened up the, the court, Lincoln County Courthouse to let us in to sign up to get married. On St. Patrick's Day. Uh, on St. Patrick's. How many years ago? I she got married in 1937. So that'd make it 37. And three, 73 years ago. Yeah, 73 years ago. And a year later, my mom's born. Mm -hmm. So that would have made her, if she was still alive, she would be like 74 years old. Mm 